Bonjour, Dave. I'm in French immersion at school, but I don't know how to type on the computer in French. Merci. That's an excellent question. I've recently created one of these videos showing how to type accented characters in Windows. In this video, I'll show you the Mac version. Those of us who live in Canada and the United States are used to using the US standard keyboard which does not have any accented characters. So for those of you with children who are in French immersion or you find yourself having to type the occasional accented character, there is a simple solution to this problem and you do not have to go out and buy a brand new keyboard. Your existing keyboard will work just fine. Let me show you how it's done. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the System Preferences menu. We're going to click on Language and Text. And we're going to look at the Input Sources. And we're going to scroll down to the United States. We'll get there eventually. And we're going to choose the US International PC Keyboard. When we're done that, Make sure there's a check mark in there and then we can close it. You'll now notice that we now have a new icon at the very top of your screen. This one looks like a little US flag. If we click on it, we can see that we have the US International Keyboard. So we're just going to click on that. And we're now seeing PC underneath that American flag. We're now ready to type using accented characters. To start with, if we want to make the E accent a goo, which is this one, we do this by typing two characters. First, we start with the apostrophe and then the E key. So these are the two characters we're typing, apostrophe and then E. We hit the apostrophe and you'll notice that it's highlighted in yellow, meaning that it's waiting for another key. So we type in the E and now we have it. If we're looking for the A accent grav, it's the same. Th it's the same thing. This is the, what we're looking for. We make the grav accent, which is on most keyboards next to the one, and push the A key, and we've got it. Circumflex, which is that one that looks like a little top hat, is simply done with a shift of the six key to make the little caret symbol. In this case here we're going to make a O circumflex. And the final one that we'll see in the French language, and in in commonly, will be the C cedille. This is formed the same way we do the accent aigu. We push the apostrophe button and push C and we have the C cedille. So we can type our accented characters no problem. But watch what happens when I try to type Jim Appel. You'll notice that because we typed the apostrophe and then the A, we got an A accent a goop, which is not what we wanted. So what happens when you actually need the apostrophe in your sentence? It's actually quite simple. When we get to the type the apostrophe, it's waiting for the second character. Just push the space bar. By pushing the space bar, you're telling the computer, no, 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 I don't want to accented character, I just want the apostrophe, and then you can continue typing the rest of the sentence. That is the one thing you need to remember with the International Keyboard. Thank you for watching this edition of Dr. Dave's Computer Home Remedies.